Hi, this is your first quarterly report for 2023. So what's going on in the local geographic area is that we are seeing consistent inventory as being pretty low. In fact, in some towns, it's anywhere from five to six homes at any given point in time in the month, which um, is very indicative of the entire country. So demand is still high, although coming down just a tad with the interest rates being in the high sixes. So some buyers are sitting on the fence waiting to enter the market while others are jumping in head first and buying homes. And we are seeing a slight increase in pricing as well as bidding wars. So it's a great time to sell. But if you look at the overall market for the last three years, starting in the pandemic 2020, 2021, and 2022, you can see below the numbers of how home sales increased and peaked in 2021 and then started to decline in 2022, which we're going to see um, a continuum of this year. You also saw a peak in pricing. So as demand got pent up and inventory got eaten up by the buyer pool, we also saw an increase in pricing peaking again in 2021. But that is slowly but surely stabling off. So it's still a great time to buy. Interest rates are in the sixes. However, they are predicted to go into the fives again. And speaking of that, do you realize that interest rates have been in the mid fives for the last three decades? So that is really our normal interest rates. What we experienced in the last couple of years with two and a half and three and a half percent is not the norm. And I don't see that happening anytime soon. So if you're waiting for that, I think you're going to be waiting a long time. And um, if you're going to be buying a house and it's going to be in the high sixes, you could only always refinance when it does come down into the fives, which I promise you it will. But if you need help in any way, please give me a call at 973-945-1070.